So yesterday about uh, 10 to 11, uh, Sunday morning, uh, we received a call for an explosion here at the Tiki Taka uh, food truck here at Muskoka Bay Park on Highway 169. No injuries, no, uh, everything was uh, just, we just had fate intervened in many cases, but no injuries reported. Um, and we're very happy about that point. So right now the fire marshal is just trying to determine, we, we as a fire department are required, if there's an explosion, any type of suspicious thing that happens, we're not saying this is suspicious, mm -hmm. but this, this qualifies as, obviously as an explosion. So we notified OFM, so they're on site and they're also working with partners from TSSA, uh, the local propane supplier, as well as Enbridge, and they're working to try to come up with a cause for the explosion mm -hmm. so that hopefully we'll, we'll know for future, we can, maybe there's something we can help prevent um, or, or the, um, you know, we, we can find a reason why. We can hopefully fix a problem before it, start, it happens again. So when will Muskoka Bay Park be open to patrons once again? That is going to be up to the insurance companies and how long the investigation takes. Once the investigation is over, I'm sure the insurance companies will come in and start cleaning up and they'll have to work with town officials as well because this is a town park and, and um, yeah, so probably, hopefully not too long. It just, it just depends on the investigation, but I know it's going to depend on, you know, you can see there's, there's lots of glass. The whole parking lot is just covered in glass and shrapnel and all sorts of things from the explosion. So, you know, it'll be open only when it's safe.